Well, hello YouTube. Good morning. Here we are. Have ourselves a start to a minus 15 Celsius morning. I guess you could say, huh, we're back to winter. Or at least a uh, tease of what winter is. And yeah, welcome to our vlog. So, here we go. Well, since we had the great weather there uh, a week or so ago, uh, the weather started to change and gradually get colder. Uh, we're not done yet on the getting the colder side of things. It is still supposed to get a little more colder than what it already is. But I guess, uh, hey, that's the way she is. Well, I am happy to say that all of the basement project videos are done, except for the, uh, well, special edition ones, which I'll probably edit up at a later date as well as I did some more editings and uh, currently doing another batch of uploadings well of course uh, the other day I had a mystery package uh, dropped on my doorstep and I was like I didn't order anything you know what what's this right it, uh, it had a Canada Post label on it so you know it was a uh, semi uh, legit if you want to say so, of course, I tore into it, and, well, this is what I found. Um, if you do some research online, you'll find uh, the price of the camera. <laughs> I'm uh, totally blown away. I've uh, held off for years buying a Canon camera, uh, mainly for one reason. It's the price only. I know I got a couple of Panasonics that uh, are probably equal in price. However, the one I bought was an open box discount because it was the display. And the second Panasonic, well, that was a gift as well, I believe, back in like 2012. So one of these days I got to film an unboxing of that, uh, throw a charge on the battery, and I get using it. One thing that's nice is it does have an external microphone, so I can wear a lapel mic when I do videos, or I can have a larger rig that has a shotgun mic on it for, well, capturing audio over wind noise. Uh, you never know, maybe this is the turning point for uh, the Canon PowerShot 610 HS. Maybe I'll end up retiring uh, this year camera because I notice it does have, it does have some spots on the lens that it can't uh, seem to get off. And uh, it's been uh, pretty much a year since I bought it and, well, it's uh, shot a lot of footage, you know. Like 150 vlogs plus uh, update videos plus uh, various Maxwell's World videos. It's been uh, in and out of the truck in the cold. Uh, I don't think I've ever really dropped it as in dropped it. Um, I might have dropped it once but I don't remember. All in all the Canon camera has been a good line of cameras for me. You never know in the future I might be able to expand even further and uh, buy one of the uh, other ones, the prosumer uh, larger ones, but I like the compactness of these type of cameras. So whoever sent me that gift, again, thank you very much. I did post it on my social medias, but so far I haven't got a reply back, so um, I suppose that's the way you know people are, right? Some people send gifts and want the notoriety of sending them. Other people send gifts, and uh, that's what they are, is their true anonymous type of gifts. Uh, when I shook the box, it kind of rattled uh, like a box of chocolates, and I thought, well, somebody sent me some, you know, chocolates or something, and here I open it, and it's like a uh, camera, and I was totally, at first I thought somebody used one of their uh, uh, recycled boxes you know, from their Christmas gift and sent me a letter and, and whatever, right? And then as I take it out of the large box it was in, I find out it's still sealed and then I cut the seal and it's like, wow, right? You know, the generosity sometimes of uh, people uh, blow you away. And then at the same time, you know, the uh, cruelty of people too at the other time 
kind of blow you away as well so you have uh, both extremes going on here but pretty much guys gonna go in the house get on with the old day and around we roll a little bit of a afternoon update well the uh, very very chilly morning has a uh, warmed up slightly not by far how what it used to be but hey you know it is what it is right well, apparently the uh, dusting of snow we got and the cold weather was just a uh, taste of what could have happened. They were saying that um, in other areas they got a, a, a lot more snow and uh, the weather's really worse than what you see here. So uh, we're really lucky. Isn't it funny how uh, when it's minus 40 and it starts to get to be minus 16, Everybody's running around in their summer coats and uh, some people even running around in their shorts. But when it's been minus five and it drops about 10 degrees, everybody finds it cold. Isn't that funny how it goes? It's kind of the same way in the fall when uh, the warm temperatures are going away and the winter temperatures are coming on, well, through or in. You know, at plus 16, you think it was uh, freezing cold in the fall. But yet, plus 16 in the spring is hot, you know. Uh, very hot. <laughs> but, pretty much, guys, my uploads are starting to wind on down. I believe I got two uh, ones left to go on through. Then, of course, I gotta go put the thumbnails and uh, all that good stuff to get them going and rolling. Uh, if my calculations are correct, I am good for, well, a few more weeks. It'll allow me to focus on what needs to be focused on. Uh, with the um, upcoming doctor's visits, depends on how they go. I will need all the uh, wiggle room that uh, I can get. And if I can shoot another batch of videos before I go, and if something does happen, then all I gotta do is edit and uh, upload them in the next uh, week or two and then uh, it'll all be fine. There should not be a, a disruption in the videos. If you're wondering what that uh, horrible racket is, um, if you guys can hear it, it's my neighbor's uh, whirly bird on the roof. It needs to be uh, greased. Usually when they make that sound, you have about a month or so, and they uh, fall off the roof because they're basically, well, NFG, right? Well, trying to decide if I want to go out and pick up some beverages for tonight or I just, uh, well, leave it as it may. Uh, sometimes if you venture out and leave your comfort zone, it's a good thing and other times it turns out to be a disaster. But, I'm gonna go in, see what's the what, and we'll probably see y'all later this evening. Come to the end of another day. Here we are at a minus uh, 23 Celsius night. Ah, the coldest night that there's been in a long time. Well, a couple weeks anyway. Like I mentioned earlier in the vlog, it's kind of weird how uh, when you're coming back out of the cold, you know, it feels warm. But when you're going back into the cold, it feels cold because you're not used to the, uh, well, the change up and down, right? Well, the rest of the evening was okay. Did a few things. Babysit the uh, uploads. Let them uh, run on down. I was going to do another uh, bulk drop. But I thought, well, let's hold off for a bit. Another week or two just to, uh, so I don't get too far ahead. Because, well, with the Maxwell's Life Entertainment channel, and now uh, effectively showcasing three videos, or three channels worth of videos, if I upload something um, a month behind or a month ahead, then by the time it goes live, it's already like buried, you know, three pages deep in my videos. So um, it takes a little bit of organization to keep things square or straight around. So if I try to keep the videos that are going live about the same time bunched together, like the vlogging channel, the fire pit channel, and the Maxwell's World videos, then when it comes time to uh, post the links and stuff like that, then they're right there. I don't have to dig through, you know, 20 or 30 videos to find them. So 
it's all good. Like I mentioned earlier about uh, getting some more content shot and uh, edited. Um, would be nice if it was all edited and I can just upload it. Because like I said, if they do do what they are saying or what I'm hoping they're going to do, um, it's going to be pretty quick from my appointment to the day. And Well, I guess it'll be what it is. But remember we do have a fan mailbox. The uh, address is down below. Um, go check that address out, write me a letter, send me a decal, and around around we go. And as always, thanks for watching Maxwell's Vlogs. Comment, subscribe, and enjoy.